Hello everyone to another uh, episode of building my ship in Starfield or should I say upgrading my ship um, from class B to class A and uh, first I want to show you what I have so first thing first is just to have a, a visual tour of my ship and as you can see um, it's uh, a max width and uh, length ship and 10 by 10 pieces but um, because in Starfield ships can't be longer and wider more than 80 meters I consider it not a big ship well, it's definitely not something from Star Trek or Star Wars where ships can uh, size in uh, hundreds of meters. So, yeah, I still consider this. This is like a, a small fighter ship. Oh, let's say medium fighter ship. Or I, I just call it a multi-role ship and um, sorry for my oxygen levels oh, let me just uh, use something oh my god so I hope this helps uh, sorry just forgot to transfer um, so as you can see It's a free story ship worth mentioning. Oh my god, this really will be annoying. I'm really sorry. Uh, let me just quickly transfer everything. Cargo holds. Inventory. Um, resources. These are the heaviest. Okay, let's just put this. Okay, still, um, still need to put something in. Uh, what about guns? So, yeah, one of my favorites. And uh, uh, because I have an alien DNA perk, I can actually transfer all my food into the cargo holes and then just sell it later. And by all food, I mean just. Uh, um, the food that has no other benefits only adds restores health so I can uh, can transfer that okay um, put this one and this one this one this one this one uh, let's see what about Definitely put this one, put the beer. Um, so I'm really annoyed by this because uh, I did it already and then I uh, my mic stopped working and I uh, had to restart my computer and uh, just uh, the safe is messed up now. One is actually is this, yeah, this one's beneficial. Um, okay, let's put this one and we're good. I'm oh, really sorry about that. So, uh, maybe I will uh, cut this off. I don't know yet. Uh, so, as you can see, it's a quite a flat ship, and uh, Sarah Morgan is it's uh yep it's uh following me in a funny funny fashion sliding um so just uh, climb on top and uh, yeah so this ship is uh basically a fusion of tile and uh, nova galactica parts 
I'm not counting the engines because the engines are from uh, different brands, I believe, all the engines and weapons. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, okay, and yes, and this, like, uh, these engines from, uh, uh, from this Deimos. So, uh, yeah. My Nova Galactica cockpit. That's very convenient to have this two-story cockpit. Uh, yeah. Probably you all are already familiar. Why? Oh my god. Okay, so uh, this is basically this is basically a Motorola ship and endgame ship. So as you can see, this is a frontier. You can uh, start with this ship and just uh, upgrade it step by step. Investing, so I, I have already invested um, 340,000 credits. Yeah, but it's uh, it can do everything. It can you see? Uh, transport cargo and uh, it's only a B class with a 21 reactor ship can hold 10 crew members it has 3200 shields almost uh, quite a good damage output at uh, okay hull so yeah and it can do everything um, and I'll show you soon I'll show you what I mean by that but uh, as you can see they have a lot of these big uh, uh, habitats and I think this is just uh, you know for a role play and also f uh, for realism just you know to have uh, the ship that is actually obvious which is you know the ship is it's basically it's a lightweight you know structure like a plane and uh, it's empty so all these spaces can you know be packed with um, can be packed with food and uh, and uh, habitats and other supplies so we have a small window here uh, just for jokes another one <laughs> just observe the entrance ah yeah so habitat um, mess hall you know stuck stuffed with food and other supplies uh, cargo holds and uh, on the uh, other side you can uh, access uh, this part of the ship which is a brig so it's a uh, you can use it for bounties as well or you know just your security office and yeah well you know we just uh, it's so safe you have a uh, access to your uh, main floor through the uh, security office so it's uh, very safe and uh, this is the front okay this is the exit <laughs> uh, yeah it's Looks like it's nipped until so, later. So, sorry, Sarah. Later. Um, also, as you can see, uh, it's not that confusing. Just uh, maybe a little bit. And uh, yeah, we have our security office, brig. So I'm really lazy. So I'm just uh, u using a boost pack to jump. So this is like a small living area um, a bird I believe all in one bird uh, oh. oh my god I'm like flash adoring fan I think I'm like flash okay um so here we have a workstation and the infirmary uh oh, sorry not infirmary but a computer core let's just finish with this side I think we're at the very edge yeah and there we have infirmary so medical station then then, then we have uh, this workshop uh, just purely for convenience because 
if you you know if you like you can you already probably know that you can switch the modules so here you go you we have um, another cargo hole and uh, here we have another room so yeah this one is just optional because I'll show you soon why I mean it's just uh, while I was upgrading I just left that for to have some extra hull points so we go in here to this part and uh, we go through these doors we have here an uh, armory and then on this side um kids looking actually how to enter cabin yeah so okay yeah, it might be uh, confusing first time. Actually, I never used it for role play. Okay, this one is a bit weird. Um, definitely can avoid this. Okay, I'll, I'll bear, bear that in mind. So we have a cockpit. Then we have a um, captain's quarters or, or a living room. Then we have another living room and we have computer station, computer core. So without any further ado, let's test the ship in combat and um, I'll show you what it can Struts do now. Retracted. And I will upgrade it to a C class, to a C class ship, and uh, you will see the difference. So it's basically, it's, it will stay, it will look the same. Just uh, will have much more features and more power. Okay, um, time to let's go. So if you want to build this ship, you can, but um, first you need to research to uh, invest your skill points into the B class ships, because A class ship, it, it, you know, you won't be able to build this big ship, but you can start actually by building my battle shuttle. Um, the link to my video will be in the description below. Okay, so yeah, again, so like it's very convenient view, you can just, just use rockets on it. Your mind. Oh. Okay, love the particle weapons. Huge range. Massive damage. Good against shields and hulls. So, yeah. Um, we can have a better look. Mm. Not uh, video mode. Let me see. Yeah, it's quite dark. Hope you can see it. So it's. I uh, think it's looking nice. And again, it's. Don't think. I don't consider it a big ship. You know, it's 80 by 80 meters, and uh, what is it, like 10 meters tall? So that's that's definitely not big for a for a spaceship. 
I mean the Boeing, the big one is, <laughs> I think it's a bigger in volume. Well, maybe not bigger, but similar. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and pick up that crate. And we can go back to Neo and upgrade the ship. So um, for those who are interested in this build, you can start, you know, you can have this at uh, class B. And then you can just upgrade it with uh, minor changes. And I'll show you what I mean by that. So, okay, Neon. go to neon okay I have contraband yeah this my safe is totally messed up because I, I before this I sold everything and uh, you know to have enough credits for upgrades it won't be cheap but it's definitely worth it and for those who are you know, love just uh, love building, grinding, flying everywhere, and building your ships. Uh, I would say this is definitely must have. Okay, thank you. Thank you. It's definitely, it's definitely a must must have ship because. Let's uh, stay away from Epsi. The okay. locals there don't exactly appreciate the tourists. Okay, let me see. Yeah. What do I have? Weapons? Nope. Yeah, and I have enough credits, so just for some reason didn't transfer my loot into the cargo holds. So, let's go. Let's upgrade my ship. Tire astroneering. Okay, where is my vendor? Every so tile in a vehicle tile is literally the best place to satisfaction is guaranteed. I never never was a fan of tile ships, but actually now I am. And let me explain why. So, it's actually it's very efficient in uh, in weight and aesthetics, and as you can see, like you have these round parts, which um, you know are landing gear, and also um, like a finisher, side finisher, because this, like you have this uh, like this uh, doorway weird looking so you have just like this nice nice round finishing also a uh, Tresta plus a uh, weapon mount so I don't think any other other manufacturer has this feature so it's very efficient plus you can um, well, Galactic also is very efficient so it's a very nice fusion so as you can see um, tanks use these tanks and I have tanks here for extra fuel and uh, uh, these are glitched in parts, but uh, I must change them, change them with uh, something not as big, uh, because it, it, it doesn't look good. Those that clipping in definitely doesn't look good. Um, so uh, let's see, what can we do? So firstly. Um, we can can get rid of this one because this is a very nice part but I'm avoiding using it because you can't actually you can't paint it I don't know why it's so like this one you can paint it but this one nope just doesn't doesn't switch painting mode on um, yeah, so let's remove it. Then we have this this thingy, which is uh, one by one. Uh, as I mentioned before, it's just uh, no, I don't want to waste my investment, my credits, and I just kept it for that extra 
five whole points. It's, it's just you know, better than nothing, I guess. Um, so we have a B21 reactor for from uh, Mion Don. And then we have, let's just remove this. Uh, we have a Aurora 11G rough drive, 27 gem chest. And as you can see, my mobility is not great. It's around 48 was 48 now it's 49 so yeah 49 it's not great because um, i have these massive cargo holds to these two massive cargo holds and uh, one shielded cargo hold for contraband in case you know because i'm um, using the ship for uh, ship raiding not pirating but ship raiding and uh, this tends to be really useful when you come across some uh, stolen art or uh, varun wiring and uh, other contraband so you can sell it to fuel your ship shipbuilding desire so yeah i also call the ship by the way a rust bucket <laughs> and uh, the, the the color resembles it you know this red rust um try to blend this with the, that big tile piece it's made the, these some parts uh, wide but they, they, they definitely look weird like ugh, i don't know and i try to avoid it at any cost okay so um, let's start from the reactor okay what about let's go for a fusion d c401 reactor and uh, I can just do this one. Okay, let's see. All right, so let's just do this because I got enough progress. Uh, enough progress to actually invest invest into the ship design uh, starship design let's do that you ready to change your life okay let's modify Yay, my let's ship. get you set up let's modify uh, let's continue modifying uh, yes, I'm also very excited. So, second stage. The engines. Um, yeah, we can do upgrade, but it won't do much, it won't do enough. Um, so, instead, I'll just throw them out, sell them, and add the ones so at my level i can already have uh, decent modules and those decent engines sorry and those are supernova 2000 engines okay one here okay one here so much better already Right, so now the crowd drive. Let's see. Okay, uh, the docker. I have the docker, it's here. Um, inside the cargo hold. Uh, hole, sorry. And, uh, um, yeah, let's go. So now we can uh, can add can add uh, as well. We can add these because I have an empty space here, and uh, sorry, and I want to fill this in something so let's just do that 
And another one here. Yeah, just, you know, just to have it in a bit more orderly fashion. Ah, then we can put this back. Um, then this one. Yeah, just let's leave it. So let's swap this one with this one. And uh, this one with this one. Let's remove these parts from Deimos. Uh, these are optional, we can use parts from tile and I'll show you show you what can we use also we can use parts from demos just uh, purely for cosmetics and optional so uh, we can use also these parts Yeah, this one. Uh, sorry, not this one, but it's similar looking. And it's this one. And uh, yeah, so we can just uh, can we can just do glitching. The glitch trick, just you know. Put it there, or we can just you know do the same thing with this part. It's just up to you. You don't even have to use uh, anything if you don't want. I mean, it's kind of okay looking. You have this like you know massive landing structure, um, which is already looking solid, and that's uh, what I like about the. Tower engineering because it's kind of you know they look very finished and they look good without uh, any you know additional cosmetics so and very functional too so yeah you can just leave it like this or add any parts you want um, just can't it's just you can just use this one here mm, why not yeah uh, as well if you prefer uh, your entry to have in the back you can do so you just can you know uh, remove this one just flip this put it there and voila have entrance at your back and you know just uh, do this looking good yeah I right. can just you know put something an extra module or just uh, you know a weapon the hard points wherever just you know some uh, some decorative part maybe extra windows whatever you like and let's go back just uh, undo this Went too far. Okay, let's just do this. Um, then we can. I'm very surprised how our mobility improved. 78 out of 49. 48. Can use these parts here. Okay. So what's the difference? I don't know, but. Okay, these, these have like this darker stripes. Yeah, let's keep it one with darker stripes. Okay, let's copy it, flip it. I uh, can use any parts you want. I really like this. So I'm using this, but you can um, use almost any part. Just bear in mind that this one needs to be connected. This part, so something for the connection point. Um, maybe even from this one, well, maybe not, um, not from this manufacturer, so with this one, yeah, kind of, can 
use this one if you want. But uh, I really like this round look. It's like an engine extension. Yep, really love this. Uh, as well, uh, bear in mind that you will have one one story deep, deep, deep extra for your new uh, warp drive and graph drive and uh, let's see we can upgrade this uh, drive so um, again guys don't uh, get mad on me about uh, you know just making this uh, extra long and maybe re you know repeating myself talking about uh, just things you already know but I'm just trying you know, to make it like all inclusive videos so it would be for everyone from for the beginners and uh, for the pros just looking for different designs so yeah this one this one needs to go but again uh, we need Stroud Eklund parts for this and uh, we, we don't have any and that's the problem okay well we can change them later so now a hey, weapons um really love these windows here yeah. but we need to we need to upgrade our weapons and uh, by that um, I really mean we need to upgrade so we can keep this but uh, won't be there won't be much of a use and uh, I will see soon why because um, I want to make from frontier I want to make a shredder and also rename it to shredder and let me explain so I want to remove these particle particle um, weapons and replace them with these amazing okay I have these um, I'm looking also forward to getting PBO 40 auto. Um, no, 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 this one, sorry. There's the, uh, yeah, Alpha Beam. Where's the Alpha? Looking forward to PBO 150 auto neutron beam, but um, they're not available for me. I think I'm. My level is too low, but. Let's just uh, re re replace these because they are really, you know, I feel they're really outdated. Slow fire rate, damage is okay, but the slow fire rate won't do much. And let's just uh, use these with this massive hull damage and also quite good shield damage, but the best point of this gun is that they actually we can have six of them but uh, as well we have another problem how to fit them on and uh, let's just put this put this here and now put this here okay we have this um doesn't look good yeah, we can just put this here. Why not? This here. You know what? Actually, what we can we do is just move this here. Yep. Just do this, then we can. Okay, we can. Uh, so we can't put this here. 
That's a really sad thing. Can we do this actually? Do this. Yeah, but then what I really find unattractive is when, you know, the guns actually obstruct each other and I I, I don't want this in my builds. I want to go for maximum realism. So, um, I already tested and uh, this is what we can do. So, let's just uh, look for these parts. And the bullets here. Let's just put this here. And put this here. So yeah, we have this like um massive gun mount. Do the same on the other side. So now we need missiles. So I don't know guys, can I just uh, I mean upgrade my missiles? Can I just uh, can I just just do this or maybe just just do this, I don't know what looks better to you. And then we can just put this here. Yeah. So yeah, looking good already. Um, what else do we need to upgrade? Yeah, these. Um, I really don't like these because they just windows to nowhere. So let's just put. Go. Let's just put some extra armor. Um, let's just flip it, put it here. Okay, let's just have some extra armor. We can do this here as well. Because I don't know, like. Just, let's just make it armor it. Armored beast. So this one's here. Okay, let's uh, let's see. Uh, time to group. Okay. So this uh, one got Hellfire Auto Cannon. Yeah, the damage is insane. Absolutely love it. Now the missiles. I've tried upgrading. Uh, I don't know if it's cheaper or not, but it's okay. Let's just use similar color scheme. What's the bucket? Team. Maybe a bit more orange. I don't know. Leave a comment. Tell me um, what is the right color for rest. Just do this. Okay. This one. Okay. This one. Bit. Just do this. So looking absolutely stunning in my opinion. So maybe some something on top. More windows. I will see the other windows. So okay, accept. It was um, quite uncheap, not cheap. One hundred forty thousand almost. Yeah. 
and let's see. Upgrade missiles. Okay, this one's nope. This one's okay, this one's looking good. 232 um, Let's cancel it um, Just I think I was looking for a different target Last time I didn't notice these but They're quite good as well Massive range three eighty four. Two three two. Three eighty four, yeah, definitely. Um, you also can buy just buy these. Ouch. Yeah, and I did it. One eighty three. Hmm. Alpha beam. I think I should upgrade to this one instead, but wait for the PBO 150 auto neutron beam. Okay, rail guns, gauss, gun, okay, so hull damage and massive shield damage and alpha beam. Okay, that's uh, that's interesting. Right, so wait. Now what's happening? Okay, this one's thirty-nine. This one's uh, massive damage, but. Slow fire rate. Yeah, kinda interesting. Um, what I tested is these missiles. They they work well, but on the second hand, maybe you know, instead of investing into all masteries like uh, missiles, particle weapons, and. Uh, um, ballistic weapons, let's just, uh, let's just uh, use uh, these ones, quite cheap as well. Mm -hmm. and, uh, let's see, these ones, 83, okay, or these ones. I never tried these ones, but these look promising. Yeah, um, hmm. yeah these ones, I, I'm sure these ones are really good. Uh, so I'll just go for these. I tried it, then I tried them many times and they didn't disappoint. So, okay, accept. Alright, so we. We have our ship, why it's highlighted. Okay, mobility drop a little bit. Um, damage, but it's still okay. So let's... Uh, let's reassign. Alpha beam, Hellfire auto cannon. And let's just uh, use... Alpha beam, and then just uh, use auto cannons here. Okay, exit, accept, and here you go. Now we have C class ship with amazing DPS. Um, let's test it, I guess. So let's go to the Astro Lounge, let's pick a mission, and let's test it. 
uh, if you like my videos leave a like and uh, subscribe to my channel let me reach 1000 subscribers by the end of this year so please subscribe leave a like let the algorithms know that I'm here and I'm making videos okay so let's go master lounge okay the party's going agent hmm, nothing Now uh, what we can do is actually go to to the creeks and try to destroy all the ships but I'm not sure if I'll be able to do that. Um, hmm. There are a lot of ships there. Too many I think too many from my level, I need more hull, way more hull health for this. Okay, so, by the way, let's uh, see our stats, again the value increased, looking way better. C 29 reactor, C clash chip, ship, uh, 20 light years jump, almost 3200 shields, uh, hull almost 1000, cargo, so yeah we easy can easily increase the cargo, we can remove these parts and switch with the cargo holds, uh, the same here, we can just uh, move these guns over here and just put some more cargo holds, even we can glitch in here cargo hold so yeah, if you decide to run cargo missions so you have like a plenty of options for cargo let's see let's count one two three four five six seven eight nine nine places for your cargo nine plus these two so 11 that's more than enough i believe for most of you um if it's not enough you can you know again just uh, replace these these uh landing gear with extra two uh just put on top if you want and uh my mother wanted me to be a doctor and let's go okay Oh, what a beautiful view. Uh, really enjoying the neon. What an amazing city. I absolutely love it. Every bit of it. Loving it. Yeah, we have here. We have a. Uh, Need some work done? Stroud and Clund. Ackland. We have uh, ship parts here. Ship builder, add. So let's see what we have. Let's see what we have in the. Okay, we have a. Uh, have these. We can use these. Yeah, we can use these. They're not as big. So, okay. This one. Okay, looking good. Um, maybe even these ones. Not sure. Just again. And some personal preferences, but I really love, like this, like almost uh, sharp pointy look. Um, again, 
first bucket team, but uh, can we have this one that looks like a rusty? Yeah, when they almost, when the tones almost match, it kind of makes this like a sporty and even look. Like it has these rust patches, but yeah, we can go like for. Difference almost. Okay, yeah, this one is nice. Like that, this really dark, like almost like glass. Yeah. And some tones it gives like this, like uh, this noisy look. Some some gives really smooth look, like it's sh gloss, like shiny, but some makes it look like like yeah you see he has these spots here the dirt and uh, decay if, if I'm right it's called decay decay or decay I'm not sure um, okay let's just uh, put it like this um, let's see the rust bucket uh, with this one it's kind of was looking nice on my battle shuttle, but now it's a bit these gaps look a bit annoying. Well, maybe we can uh, do something about that. Um, let's see, we can just uh, can do this maybe. this I don't know if it looks better or not let me know in the comments below so again we can move this um, can uh, add this so the how much we we increased yeah it's the same no difference can also have this customization maybe you know just uh, okay that's fine hmm. okay this one's a bit of a gap here but uh, I guess it's fine let's see um, so sometimes I try to mask it by using you know like these type of parts which are a little bit longer maybe not this but um hmm. we can actually nope okay so not sure if it was a good idea to do that, but uh, let's let's continue. I guess, and yeah, maybe even this one. Hmm. Another variant. Let's just remove these parts. Okay, let's put this back. Um, maybe we can put maybe this one. Didn't work. Didn't work as I intended. So this one's. Yeah, this one. I think it looks kind of better. Or maybe not. 
Um, let me know in the comments below what would you use. I'll just try you now. Maybe just to remove these at all. Just to have this like. Uh, nah. I think it takes the uh, all this smooth look away. So what else can okay, we do this one? Alright, let's see. This one. Yeah, let's just... Uh, let's just uh, keep this one. After all. It's fine. Let's put these guns a bit further from the cabin. You know, you don't want these weapons just uh, firing too close. Okay, this one. This one. This one, I think it's a bit lighter. And it's fine. Okay. Looking uh, exactly as I wanted. So, let's see. Um, just let's let me use fast travel to go to where I wanna be to get those missions. So I believe the the best missions are in Aquila City. If you join the Frangents. And uh, no. Uh, another option is yeah. Let's just go there. Yeah, just let's get this banshee. Let's just let's just go for it. Okay, I believe we can do it. Okay. Okay, uh, forgot to do something. Sorry. Whoa, okay. Okay, nice. Wow, almost instant death. These uh, Gatling guns. Okay, that was a close one to draining completely my shields, but uh, as you can see, this ship is a beast. Yeah, nice, nice shooting pattern. Um, but it can. Yeah. So, in this situation, actually, maybe I should have uh, actually bought missiles because because missiles, you know, you don't fire missiles that often, so you don't need that much energy Just for the particle weapons. But, uh, Well, um, I would change those uh, those alpha beams into the missiles, you know, just to have. I mean, it's a, this is enough. These Vanguard obliterators, flux, Gatling guns. That's enough. As you can see, those Gatling guns just chew, chew through their hull like nobody's business. 
Okay, let's uh, just material deposit. Nope. Let's get that phantom. Yeah, it's still very slow, but. Yeah, but it's looking nice, all these, these engines, these auto cannons. But yeah, uh, definitely I would recommend to upgrade reactor to uh, feed those uh, Gatling guns. Yes, yeah, so you can see I'm sitting there. Let's Okay, cargo hold is full. That's not good. So what I'm actually looking for is credits. We need credits to fuel our uh, upgrades. So let's just... Uh, It's still disappointingly slow. And this, this is very powerful. Okay, so we're just going in circles. Ah, oh, never mind. This one, I think we've been there. Deposit. Yeah, never mind. Um, let's just uh, let's just try one more thing. And uh, the ultimate challenge. Got to forgot to put my points into the shields. Oh god, it's not good. Yep. Um. Okay, this one. Okay, let's use this one. That's not good. Yeah, and we're dead. Yeah, just basically those... It's not enough power. Not enough power to feed all the weapons and uh, also my mistake for not... Yeah, again. Oh my god, so many of them. Okay, it's not instant death. Oh. Yeah, so not my mistakes so guys i hope you enjoyed this episode if you did leave a like leave me a comment leave me a comment um what you would have done in my place and also what you would like to see in my other videos love you guys i hope you enjoyed this episode and uh, see you in the future. Bye.
hope I can escape. Oh dear. Yep, we're fine. 